increased immigration quotas for the year 2021. Quebec intends to increase immigration quotas. Nadine Giroult, the province's immigration minister announced on the 29th of April 2021. Giroult confirmed that the COVID pandemic decelerated immigration, while Quebec's already existing acute labor shortage persisted to surge. Giroult further mentioned that Quebec faced a shortfall of approximately 17,000 or 18,000 individuals immigrating to the province in the year 2020. Quebec Economic Immigration Goals In the year 2020, Quebec greeted approximately 25,000 immigrants, but had arranged for between 43,000 and 44,000 new immigrants to fill the labor scarcity. Quebec's government dropped the province's immigration quotas when it came into power in the year 2019, but has intended investment to upsurge immigration. To make sure the survival of this francophone character of Montreal, Quebec appended $70 million to the francisation effort in the previous budget, bringing the total to $170 million. Capitalized $24 million to greet newcomers to Montreal. Jean Boulay, Quebec's Labour Minister mentioned that, province's government is revising immigration regulations, in order to help tackle the present labour shortage to increase the quotas and streamline the immigration process. In April 2021, Canada revealed three new immigration paths to permanent residency for francophones and bilingual immigrants who are presently residing in Canada. Are you interested in immigrating to Quebec, Canada? Please keep in mind that Quebec's economic immigration program is for immigrants who have established that they can effectively integrate into Quebec society through skilled work experience in Quebec or through international post-secondary education in Quebec. Quebec's official language is French and the province give precedence to French-speaking or bilingual immigrants. In the year 2021, Quebec's goal is to receive between 43,000 and 44,500 immigrants. This is the end of today's video update. Please don't forget to comment below and share your thoughts with us. Thanks for watching today's video update.